Welcome back to another edition of Trial by Fire. Today I'm going to be trying a sauce from a company I have not done in a little while. It's Pepper North. This one is a Red Serrano and Reaper sauce. It is a 9 out of 10 on their scale. I thought I had actually done this sauce until I looked at my sauces that I have done and found out I didn't. Now they do some amazing sauces. <clears throat> they are flavorful. They have the heat. You're not giving up anything on any of their sauces. Now, they do have a wide variety of sauces and they've changed their labels. That's one of the reasons why I thought maybe I had done this one. So I'll show you here. We, their Northern Lights one, this one has been discontinued, unfortunately. Uh, it is a Verde style roasted pepper sauce. It's like a mild sauce. But yeah, they did discontinue this one, unfortunately. And then they have their Solar Flare, which is a medium, which is a smoked pineapple and habanero sauce, which is really good. <coughs> and then one of my favorites of theirs is the Blueberry Plague. Now, with the changing of the labels, they have actually changed this one. If I can get it out here. This is what the new label looks like. So they, they have they've gone with this very simplistic label design which is nice, uh, but then it's now being called Wild Blueberry and Scorpion instead of Blueberry Plague. And it's a 7 out of 10, but it's absolutely amazing sauce. It's putting this on ice cream or anything, actually, is really good. Uh, I do try to keep a few extra bottles on hand so I've got a few here and then you've got your momentum sauce which is a on this one is a hot it's a black cherry and reaper one and they changed that one keeping the same name but they've it's an 8 out of 10 so they changed that label over now when I saw this one the one I'm going to do today I originally thought maybe it might have been this one, which is the Stargazer, which is Scotch Bonnet and Ghost Pepper. Because I just color wise, I thought maybe it was the same one, which amazing sauce as well. And then I'm like, okay, well, maybe not. But they also have the Totality, which I've done videos on all of these. This one is a, is a 10 out of 10 or 11 out of 10, they put it at. It's an ultra high. The link will be in the description for this one. Yeah, that's where I thought I was kind of like, oh yeah, I've done this one. No need to worry about it. <laughs> Until I got looking at it again. And Red Serrano and Reaper. Now they do have another one out there that I believe I haven't done before, so I'm going to try and get a hold of that one too. But yeah, so without further ado, let's get into the unbottling. Or unbottling. And uh, clean heat is what they... Uh, seem to have on all their uh, labels now. So I'm not sure if they're just being like clean flavor. You need maybe to change the uh, for, uh, formula, yeah, the mad science formula. Change the uh, process up a little bit. But good consistency. This one, uh, according to their website, they've got it. Their suggestions for food to put this on is pizza, Tacos, breakfast burritos, chili, or anything else that you need to crack, crank up with a little bit of heat. The ingredients are obviously Serrano Pepper, Carolina Reaper, um, both mash uh, with distilled vinegar, sugar from maple syrup, and I know it's uh, Canadian maple syrup, they advertise that all the time for that. Apple cider vinegar, lime juice, garlic, sea salt, Reaper pepper powder, and chipotle pepper powder. So we got Reaper in there twice. So, this should be interesting. <clears throat> you can smell the reaper. Wow, can you smell the reaper? Ooh. Oh, <coughs> clean up my nose, that's for sure. Okay, so it's good to say. Nice little. Oh, whoa. 
little more than I want. Yeah, I came to the bottle. <laughs> a little thinner than I was expecting. And I'm not sure if I want it down that much. Um, quarter of this spoon might be a little much at first. <clears throat> Yeah. Very Reaper forward on the smell. But then you've got Toronto Reaper mash and then Reaper powder as well. So I'm expecting a good kick out of this one. If you enjoyed this content, don't forget to subscribe. Click the notification bell so you won't miss any new videos coming out. Cheers. Oh yeah. <coughs> she got a kick. <coughs> wow. It's dissipating already. Like more or less in the month, back and throat starting to get now. <clears throat> wow. <clears throat> Tasty and as I say, clean and heat. But wow, that's pat to punch. Definitely <clears throat> if you're looking to put some heat in something that will do it. Which <clears throat> just kind of right back in here right now. Gluten-free, no preservatives, vegan. Where are they out of again? <clears throat> I know they're out of Ontario, I believe. I could be wrong. Um, do, do, do. What does it say on here? Yeah. Oshawa, Ontario. So, <clears throat> not far out of Toronto, if for those who don't know Ontario or Canada very well. It's actually really good. Lingering heat in a good way. They let you know it was there. They said, hey, remember me? <laughs> but yeah, Red Strong and Reaper. They're not in town. I would agree with them in their levels it's nothing like the totality that one yeah watch the video and you'll you'll see what i said about that one um <clears throat> but that is it's a clean very clean burn and nice taste mm. yeah i would say flavor wise i'd probably get that about a seven or an eight out of ten heat wise for the quick heat that it hits you with i would say it's probably about a three or a four but then dumbs down to a two very quickly it has kind of <clears throat> open up the airways which is nice it's been a little stuffy lately <laughs> But yeah, that's about it for this one. So uh, enjoy the heat, stay spicy. We'll see you next time where who knows what I'll be trying or what I'll be doing. If you guys have suggestions on what to sauces or anything, put them in the uh, comments. Let me know if I can get hold of them, I will. If I have them or if I've done them already, I'll put links or whatever. Hard to remember sometimes when I got, well, not so, so many videos, but over 200 videos out there now, so. Sometimes the memory doesn't quite uh, work as well as it does, used to. But, yeah. We'll see you next time. Take care. Very nice. Very nice indeed. <laughs>